FIFA foe, match please start on go.
fuck, I don't know. I don't know. Hello, everybody. I'm gonna make the music a bit quieter there. Hello, everybody. Um, you might might have noticed that we have not switched the scene yet because I'm. Maybe it's two minutes before the start open. Why are you not on the server yet? Well, I have not received the password. Neither has any second ID. So we're waiting at the moment that we might get a password. You know, just in case that we might start getting a comp match that's supposed to start in two minutes. And I, I'm, I'm waiting for this because lately when I try to join servers that were password protected or like you know, comp streams, uh, sorry, comp servers, I had to take like, depending on how it works, 15, 20 minutes. So we might lose the start here completely because nobody can start on time because dry runs, you know, that's, that's what the teams do. They need to do dry runs till the last few seconds and then one second before it's uh, over time, then you go, oh yeah, by the way, here's the password. Ah. Is it annoying? Absolutely. Is it a joke? Yeah. Ah, oh well. Oh well. But that, that is what we can do. At least I see that the stream has started 30 minutes ago. That's a fun one, you know? That That's a fun one, I guess. Uh, gives me at least time to send out the pings and all the other things. You know that because the game is going to start in 30 minutes. Well, well no, because they, they, they don't want to share their, their password for their servers. We can join. Ah, oh well. Mm -mm -mm. Yeah, but let me just send these things out. At least, you know, it's the moment where we can talk, kind of, but kind of not, because there's this giant delay of, of nothingness and things. Yay. Uh, sending that one out, sending that one out. Yeah, I know, I would be lovely if we could just start this. I know, I know. Let me just remove this, there we go. And do we have a thing, because it's literally the starting time right now? Anything? Nope. Still nothing. Okay. Ah, so not only did we need to help buy time for for no, before they flip the map, but also before they give the password out for the other team to join. Too long didn't read. Yeah, cool, Lira. Yeah, you might want to. Maybe at some point you want to get the password out or something. Yeah. <sighs> If they if they actually forfeit, I'm gonna I'm gonna lose my shit because it has mm. nah they're not. Hey, cool! They finally decided to make the thing cool. Well, it is it is a few seconds after starting time, so automatic loss for the line. Nah, nah, nah. <laughs> Imagine that being the case. Good God, the the level of jokery and memes. Ah, oh, it would have been hilarious. <laughs> So how did the 80 second day tickets TL match went? Well, they, they went, they were five seconds late, so they lost. Oh, really? Yeah, no, it's in the rules. Is it? Not really, no, no, I don't think so. Didn't make the rules because that, that would be very mean against the teams. All right, but I'm, I'm jumping over. Maybe, maybe this is finally working for once because, you know, ooh, the animation, ooh, the lag. But that is because, yeah, because Heaven Lose is again, ah. Oh, but we can't see anything right now. I know, I know, kids. I know, believe me, I can't see anything either. Because Headed Loose is, is somewhere hidden in the loading screen. Might pop up in a second now, because the loading screen for some reason doesn't get captured by OBS. Sometimes. Don't know why. But we actually better tap out and it freezes for a moment. Oh well. Uh, but in a moment it should hopefully load. I had some issues in the past, which took like 15, 20 minutes to actually join the thing. But I'm sure everything will be fine in a moment. It is trying to load the server, that's nice. And I did find the server instantly, except now in the past I had some issues. Uh, it seems like the patch actually fixed that problem, that I can actually join servers now instantly. And don't have to try for 15 minutes, that's nice. <sighs> I would be lovely if I could actually see the game on the OBS. There we go, look at that, isn't that fancy with all the things? And 80 second also received the information so they can also now join. Yay! Let me just join a squad. I just want to see if I have admin cam. Just, just making sure that they didn't forget that one, you know? Why am I already second, brother? I should have been on the other side. Nah, well. Let me just check this. Not important. I just want to see if I have my thing. And I don't have admin cam. Ah, oh, great. Cool. Cool. Okay, let me just do this, because I did not receive admin cam, and we ping all of them, because they couldn't be bothered to do it. See, that's when you start not doing matches for teams anymore, because they couldn't be bothered. Also ping Ghosty, cause things. Bop, 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 bop. Because the match should have started two minutes ago, and they didn't give me admin cam. Cool. <laughs> 
dumbest shit ever. Ah, uh, at least they had a little thing there, sure. Alright, see if we get any admin cam in a moment. Ah, isn't that fun, isn't that fun. Isn't that fee foo fa fun Fixed. Ah, cool. <sighs> nope. Nope. Hey, I was it for a second, and I don't have it anymore. What is going on? Now I have it again. What the fuck is going on? All the buttons working or randomly not working. I love it. Ah, that's how we want it. All right, let me just confirm it. So they have... Works now. Oddly a bit wonky, though. But works. I don't know, that was weird because I... Let me just try this again. Because I, I pressed it. Okay, it works now completely. Okay. Because I pressed the button and it didn't work. And then it, like, five seconds later reacted to it. Trying to use you as a shield stopper, right? Ah, but yeah, we're waiting for the start of this. Hello. <laughs> Got you sticky. There you go. Anyways, but this is gonna be Zach Marie Egle. And we should have the start, you know, in the next five hours. I, I make the jokes here, of course, because we were waiting. But then again, they have to literally just join right now. All these lovely faces. And we should have the start in a moment. Oh, but you're still playing music. I know, I know. Don't you worry, they're gonna have the music removed in a moment. Uh, do we have actually? Did I? Yeah, I, I see the little brrrt sounds and thing. We have, we have audio. All good. All. But in a moment, we're gonna have the lovely gamings of the line against 82nd AD. I should probably run a, a, an ad like. Hmm, what will it be? It will be like. Then 30 minutes plus right now. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm just thinking because I know nah, because Twitch does the whole thing about oh we have to run ads automatically for people so I try to basically run the ad just before the stream starts. No, nope, before the match starts, so to say. So right now somebody hopefully in chat will say Alberg, please run an ad right now because it's about to start. So something like that would be glorious. Hopefully something is somebody's doing that. Else I hopefully will remember it's there just before we have to start. Anyways, it's gonna be Sankt Maria clean, as you can see. Uh, right now, there might be access, but in a moment, they're gonna flippity flippity flip on the US side, and they're gonna have our friends from the line on the US side, and our friends from 82nd AD on the access side. We'll check down the side. Good, good, good. Ah, and it's gonna be a fun, 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 fun one. Also, a little heads up for the other people. I am going to do some random streams to repeat. Yada, yada, yada. There, that's me. If you don't have any interest in non headed loose stuff, then uh, it's not gonna be interesting. Sorry, if you have interest in headed loose stuff, then. If you have no interest in headed loose stuff, then it will be interesting for you if you are only focused on headed loose. The weak streams are not gonna be that interesting because it's gonna be random games. You might even do some Void Crew and give some free keys away because I got some extra keys for that one. Anyways, and then on the weekend we should have another cop match. HCA, ECL. Don't think seasonal is starting yet. I think that is still late, something like that. Right, like one week. We'll see. We'll see how it goes. But right now, what I want to see is the start of this match. Uh, 99 people. Don't think it's going to be anybody else. It's going to be no more. Let me just check on the side. 99, let's go. Let me just type this, maybe. People then decide to start this match, which should have started six minutes ago. But, you know, I was expecting... Actually, sorry. I was expecting for this match to start sooner than the official time, because 82nd AD was playing. Cam enabled. What? What? Did they... What? Okay, for a second I thought it... Okay, everything's fine. You know, always worrying when you get like... You already have the thing and then you get like a pop-up. Hey, by the way, you have no the power. What? What? Really? Anyways, we are gonna see... What are we gonna see? We're gonna see either Checkpoint or Hospice. Uh, we're not gonna see St. Marie Egle because we never get St. Marie Egle. Sadly, even on St. Marie Egle, you never get the hard point in the middle. Center middle. Would be fun. Would love to see that, but I think it's gonna be either check sorry, either checkpoint or hospice up there. Uh, which means we will have open areas, lots of tank fights, uh, long ranging firefights near hedges, and some people that make their way over this weed field. That's the word I was looking for. That's gonna be a thing we're gonna see in a moment. And. 
depending on how no, what the area is. And we are apparently are about to start this. I'm gonna cut the music. Just gonna check that everything else is working. You, 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 you. Everything is good. Sound is there. Thing is there. Uh, 30 minutes from now on. That means. 30 minutes from now on. Yay. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's also fine. There we go. I just wrote in chat. And we're gonna see what we have visual. Visual? Map wise. That's because. It's always bad when you have to, like, fill in. 10 minutes of random nothingness with just ramblings. You know, that's always a bad one. Ah, but in 30 minutes, we will have the lovely, lovely, lovely start of this. Let me just also do a prediction, because why not? Prediction. There we go. Start prediction. Who's going to win this on the Twitch? There we go. Yada, yada, yada. Is it going to be TL or is it going to be uh, 80 second AD? There we go. Why is this so odd looking? Don't be a third option. There we go. And 30 minutes time to vote on that. There we go. Got it. Can the game please load at some point? That would be glorious. Hey, the game has decided to load. That is nice. Not like I'm missing something. It's Saint Marie Eglé. Look at that. It's an S. Top, top, middle, bottom, bottom. Sexy. Like that. Good. Uh, do we have shitty somewhere? Where is shitty? CD, CD, CD. Where are you, buddy? And has CD renamed himself because I'm supposed to join CD? I don't see CD. Cool. Where's CD? Uh, can somebody please cast the TL that? Yeah, join CD. Okay, where's CD? Oh, CD's not playing. Cool. Uh, cool. Whom to join? See no CD. I, I mean, in the worst case, I'm just going to join any fucking squad because they couldn't be bothered with anything. So I might just, you know, I might just join anybody because why the F not? Why the F not? Maybe they renamed themselves again because that's also a fun one. Ah, uh, you know, I might just, just don't cast these games. Ah, uh, yeah, random nonsense. Okay. You know, I might just block a squad. Who cares at this point? Who cares at this point? See, that's me getting slowly fed up because they couldn't be bothered with giving me any info. Jimmy and sure, maybe that's... Okay, I'm gonna get that person. Sure. Where's that prep? And yes, I'm trying to get the mood up because this, this shit is annoying me over time. Could just send everything. Are we gonna get the start? Yeah, just barely. Cool. Ah. Uh... Nah, I can't, can't give admin camp. Sorry, can't start on time or even 50 minutes earlier. Nah, nah, I have to start after match already started. Well, the time would have started. Can't give admin camp. Can't have shit. Now stuff freezes. Cool. There we go. 20 seconds in. We're about to do our thing. Let's try to have some fun on this. Ah. Ooh, different sound from back. Ooh, they changed the sound of that one. Didn't even notice that one. Anyways, hello everybody. TL against. 80 second date. And if we block a squad, then who cares at this point? Tough shitties. <sighs> Alright, all I want to see is some lovely truck snipes right now. From either side, Harriet can do that. You know, they can. Both sides can do that. I don't care which side is doing the, the glorious funsies. As long as it's glorious. And I will probably. Yeah, 1 hour 10, I will probably start like an ad thing. 30 minutes minus, no, that should be just before we have to start. But so far, I don't see any explosion, I don't see any death, and Doom would be mostly up there, in that little area. Ah, artillery is being blasted on the TL side, TL is shelling already. Well, already. They are starting to shell, would be lovely to have another caster on the other slot, but you know how it is. When it's not... Ooh, that was good. That was good. There was, there was some nice little rockets there. Some beautiful rockets in that spot. Problem is there's nobody there that they could actually shell. And they really like to blast that spot there, even though nobody is there. I mean, that, that area is... I mean, if they kill the Puma, I'm gonna be actually quite amazed. Yeah. Ah, and the Puma made it through. Ah, it would have been a fun one. If they actually, with a random rocket, had killed... There's like four people in the Puma. Look at that. Ken for the Bob, Bang, Jackal, and Jem. What a... 
What a lovely troop of crazy nuts. Yep. Entering the area. Lovely little move there. And they're going in. They're shelling the entryway. That's not going to do much. <laughs> and the tag blasts the assault team. And gets destroyed. Okay, I'm already happy with this match. I'm already happy. Okay, 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 okay. <laughs> and right now it seems like, I mean, to be fair, it is an American favorite point. It is TL that's currently covering, covering, capturing this. Havel, Havel. Let me drink something. Let me drink something, kids. Oh. Mm. Ah, there we go. Heavy push in the north. Uh, the south at the moment looks, yeah, still the garden area is being flooded by the blue team here. TL is pushing in. Glorious. Master of Funk Tech Contestant goes down and at least stays near the wall. It's cool, stone, it's refreshing, it's nice, it's fine. But then was quicker. Then firefights are breaking out to the south. You see at the moment losing those firefights. Then again, they are dominating the firefights apparently in the north. Eh, yeah, bit of a thing's going on here. Now, mind you, that little strike force there with Swellboy and the others, they, they could actually break through here. Mind you, the open area is problematic, and also the point goes after six minutes nearly towards the lovely people from the line. And I don't mean the lion, I mean the line. Do we have any sneaky people at Rute Haras? No, no sneaky people. No sneaky people at all. 82nd AD has not set up a f Sorry, the line has not set up a thing there. Originally, was I was going to be on the 82nd AD side, eh, but then, yeah, they we didn't have a TL match in ages, and then, like, TL didn't get their side covers, so I thought, you know what, guys, I'm gonna be on your side. And right now, it might be me on the winning team here tonight, because right now they have the advantage, hard point-wise. It being Zap Marie Eggly. Now, mind you, that doesn't mean that they will keep Zap Marie Eggly, Because sneaky little beast like Gunshow here can make lots of big plays happen. Might it be garrisons? Might it be OPs that are plonked together? The thing is, they need to find them, though. And as we have seen on this map... What was it? It was ESP... Oh, Jimmy's not on artillery anymore. Is that gonna be a problem? Look on the... Can you join RD? No, I can't join it because I was told who to join and I asked and you, people said, oh, Chimney Lobo. Okay, then I'm gonna join you. Tough shit. <sighs> Actually, I'm curious. Let me just open the map. Who is, who is on the RD? Is he named CD? No, not called CD. Not the person I'm supposed to join. I asked multiple times. Nobody could be bothered. Can't be bothered anymore. If you can't be bothered, do your job. Mm -mm -mm. I can just kick me from the squad. As well. Works the same. Just kick the people from the squad, then it's not important anymore. And I'm going just not down because everything is already doomed down there. Yeah. I don't want to say it, but it seems like the line is slowly losing some ground here. They are losing ground at the moment. Nah, nah, I was about to say they are losing ground, but they have it under control. TL has it under control. There is some little frays up there in the north. That should have been the truck, I would assume, correctly, right? Yeah, truck, access truck, that's fine. both sides is hammering down it is not the most how should i phrase it it's not the most dramatic fighting up here it's not the most condensed fighting area thanks making the way and slightly bonking into walls no mind you that player might have a, what is it called a, a white screen monitor he's also getting pummeled flicker knock prick and maddie all getting pummeled i would assume from a tank down the motorway yeah Medium tank down there. And is escaping to the side. Fair enough, fair enough. No, 80 second AD is slowly pushing in here on the south. As you can see, as you can see, let me just do a little. Let me go. 
You can see that they're actually pushing in quite beautifully in the south. And might tr they might try to basically set up a bit of a forefront here at the south area. And then go mm, at least partially eastwards to this level. And then make their way northwards. Basically where blue is right now. Any second D could do some nice pushes here. I think there's also... I might be wrong on that, but I think... Wasn't there a garrison or something? Uh, no, no, not really. Okay. Oh, no, there is one. Bit far away, should not get seen. That should be fine. And right now, they are just trying to spread out here. Problem is, the line is going in between those little spots. And the hammering down. Colts are trying to get an OP down somewhere. Slavic the same. Problem is, there's so many enemies all around them. And it will be pretty hard to set something up. Oh well, oh well, oh well. Oh well, oh well, oh well. And in the meantime, I am waiting for the glorious moment here where they are. Yeah, this second is setting something up here. They're getting more and more people in. Colts are Slavic down there as well. Yeah, they're setting. At least they're getting into the formation. They're getting into the spots, no? Only Covenant still alive. I'm gonna actually check on these. Is Covenant just... Oops, what is he doing? Where are you, boy? Where are you? Blah. I mean, it's the last man in this area. I'm just gonna keep it on there for a moment. Is that... Well, good thing they... <laughs> and there we go with Covenant done. Good thing you cannot make it onto those spots that you shouldn't be anymore in this game, you know? Good that you can not be anymore on roofs and other things. Good thing it has been fixed, you know? That's not an issue anymore in this game. I can take the victory there. Now the line is pushing a bit back here again. It's trying to find their little spots there. No mind that it's a very sneaky spot there for Slavic, who is not gonna get spotted that easily. Ah, it's gonna take some. That's gonna take them some time to. It's gonna take some. Oh my god! It's gonna take them some time. There we go, English. It's not that hard, is it? Mind you, 82nd AD has been pushed away a bit in the south. They have taken a bit of a refugee down there further south, though. But the initial closeness to St. Maria Gle is currently being defended. The garden area is being protected. Frogas, the Mad Dutchman, is wobbling forward. And nearly got burned alive. Jumped over, saw the flamethrower, and went back. This frog is not going to get boiled. Is he going to blast himself now with the grenade there? No. That was a really good grenade. It was really well pointed there. You know, I, I don't get to praise Frogas that often because I don't get him a lot. And because I do both 80 versus 18 and things. But that went quite alright. And I think I'm gonna run an ad now because then we don't have ads later. Yeah, that, that, would, that should be good right now. Time wise. Uh, buttons, 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 buttons. Button. Button. Good. Buttons. <sighs> and while I did the little thing there on the side, I see that Frogger has died, which is a bit disappointing. I also see that a second AD has made their way into the holy place. Yelma, Longs, others are making their way into the hard point. And they have all the data they needed. They get them and they're actually inside the church. Anybody top? Nobody top at the moment. Tank also getting hammered with that tank. Coletto, I see a little sticky. Grakar at the moment. That was the group that was also fighting the... What was it? Panzer 4? I think Panzer 4. Up there, up the road in the north a moment ago. Mind you, there was also the little... Did they lose the tank just now? Yeah, just checking. Did they... That looks tanky. That looks like that uh, Panzer 4 is down. Killed by who is that? Let's get some names. Mr. Doom, Bossman, and... Can't read it because... Uh, free Bras. There we go. Now, mind you, German lungs have an issue. They are getting blasted inside the church right now. And the problem is they are surrounded completely. Strike Longs from that list of names. Strike him from the list of names right now. 
They should have everything under control. It's only Yelman who is currently up there in the church tower. Ah, that, that's a spot we have all at some point. Uh, look at that. That little ringly hole down to the holy place. That sounds good. I mean, it's a good spot. How is Flip also... Okay, what is going on? What is TL doing? The line is not protecting this little diagonal push area here. They are not defending this crossing section. If people are able to make their way into the church, that's not something that should happen. Imagine there might be an OP close by or something like that. Nah, because there's nobody right now in this garden area. They could, sorry, in this greenery area. There could be an OP somewhere here and nobody sees it. But right now, I would say they have it at least somewhere under control, at least around, sorry, surrounding the area. There's a little bit of a push coming up in the north from 82nd AD. The south is still holding 82nd AD, not with too many units anymore down there south. Frog is still alive, and I also see that something has been blown up. That is a truck, not a lot. Dan doing some killies, why not? Let's get, let's get some down to the earth gameplay in. Once again, Dan. Dan gets another kill in. And he's about to get shot by cost. Maybe not. Bam! Oh, that was... That was some oomph behind. That was a good... I don't know why, but... I mean, it was just a normal shot, but... I don't know. Shotguns have that little extra boost of joy when you hear them. Uh, be successful. Now, mind you, speaking of successful, how is it on the defense side? 80 second 80. Um... Did I miss a hard point in between? Wow. Wow, that is... That is an empty area. That is very empty. I mean, I see fingers and beaver bang up there in the north. Fair enough. Um, except that, that is a very... Wow. 82nd AD not putting anybody on defense anywhere. Not even in the proximity. I guess beaver bang kind of... They're having some people here defend against two men down here. Um... Okay. I mean, why, why would you have people on defense when you're literally on the enemy hard point? The <laughs> Did I miss something? It's 80 seconds. <laughs> Sorry. I, I mean, come on. What, what is this man? And 80 second 80 is starting to capture the point here. Can I... Can, what? Gunshot lies and does not get the kill. Kender, Kender, shoot you silly goose, what is he doing? What is this nonsense? Oh, Kender. Sorry, why are you not sh The fuck? Sorry, what is this? Yes, Cosmos, what is this? Why did nobody shoot the German? I mean, I'm the last to say that because, you know, hmm, hello, guten Tag. But still, why did nobody shoot the guy there? They did not realize that the... <laughs> I don't. This is a weird one. This is a weird one. Okay. Anyways, 80 second AD while going there for the brownie points. They could have just he could have just done the killings. That's gonna pay them so bigly. Ah. Uh, he could have wiped the whole group that lied and sorry. Stayed in wait there. Could have found more people that come around. And right now all of these people could be blocked. But he tried to get for the style points. And that is now biting them in the butt. Much bite biting. 80 second 80 loses the push power here. Where? They have an OP there at the... Oh my god. 80 second 80 has a spawn right on the enemy hard point. Surely somebody is going to notice the, 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 the quick burst of enemies. 80 second 80 still pushing in again. I'm, I'm going to make this a bit cinematic there. There we go. little cinematic push for everybody. There we go. Might even shut up for a moment. Just, you know, gonna make it a bit louder as well. Why not? Because this is a great moment. <laughs> okay, that might be a bit too loud. Okay, okay, let's go back with the volume. It's not an ASMR stream. I mean, what would be the point if I just recorded it without any cast? 
But right now, 82nd Media has a very finicky little push power here because they have only flipping gun show here. They lost their OP just a moment ago. The line is also starting to surround this area. They would have needed some people in here. Right now, that's not the thing that's going to work out here. That is not going to be a thing. It's an odd one. It's an odd one, though. And such a blast, everybody inside the place. Aye, 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 aye. And the line has the area again under control completely. The whole point is again under control. No wonder I see Frogger's there in the north, and others making their way. There is some little dops in the north and the south, but overall, the line has the area under control. Little, let's make a little, you know what? Little 360. Okay, that is a bit too fast. Let's make it slow, little 360. There we go. But is he Sergio? Is Sergio 82nd? No. I keep forgetting where Sergio was. Who was before on the Malditos Bastardos? Uh, the Spanish national... Sorry, the special national team. The Span one of the Spanish teams next to 501... Um, uh, dot .es. I was wondering what AS is, was. Spain, yeah. España. Is Raymond on, really? Huh. Odd, but sure. And now he has found his way to the 82nd gate. Yes, many have in the past, and many will again in the future. Fun against Tristan, MG hammers him down. Zooming out a bit, just getting some of the action here again. Bit of a push power here. Not sure, I, I guess, I was gonna say not sure, but I guess just because of so many people that are pushing into the sector here, should get defended with another spawn wave, should be easily defended. Don't see it yet as a dangerous push because they're literally just trying to make their way into the area here. Mind you, if they're losing firefights like that, then maybe there's a bit of a danger here, but uh, it should be all good. Should be all good. Should be all good. Never mind. <laughs> nah. Not the real audio for the plane. But right now, as you can see, I should probably uh, uh, move this so the north is north and south is south. Let me just move this. Yeah. I mean, you can see they make a bit of a fight here in hospice. I'm just going to make a bit of a downwards thing. Yeah. I mean, look at this. They're fighting over here in hospice area. They then make their way on the main roads a bit. A bit of a fighting in the garden areas. Still, most fights are happening here at the crossroad action northwest of... Confused. Northwest of St. Maria Gle. Bit of a cut through there by 82nd Media in the garden area on the southeast. And the southeast is filled with red dots. Is that enough at the moment? No, yes. I'm going to show the map for one little second here. The line is having a very... Look at that. Two garrisons on the attack. Two red zone garrisons. But nobody pushing the route to Haras. On south. Very, very far away garrisons also. Look at that. One here. One up there. One down there. Not, nothing at the front line itself. One backup garrison. Nothing on Mason the Creek. Bits. I guess they're putting it into special places, but, you know, like, oh, we, we can't go there. How is Rute Haras at the moment? Yeah, you know, send one guy and they can capture it on his own. Yeah, yeah. The line not really pushing, I guess. They're in here for the 90-minute min game. Which we I have no problem with, because that means I get to see a 90-minute match. Yay. And in just seven minutes, people on the stream should also see the start of the match. And me getting salty about stuff not working out. Ah, uh, always fun. Oh. Now, mind you, again, Yelman is there on the church area. How is that a thing that can keep on happening? You have the hardpoint advantage. Surely you can... Oh, so it's gem behind the building there. Oh. Yelman about to get popped. And gets popped. You might be satcheled in here. Uh, let's see if you get satcheled. Don't think you're getting satcheled there. Well, maybe Greka Coco might die. Oji Panda as well if there's a satchel there. Eh. Looks unsatcheled there. I mean, it was an assault pool. Oh, was it assault? What was it? You know, Yelman was a squad leader, wasn't it? I forgot. Oh, shit. That, that's embarrassing. Okay, sorry about that one. I'm, I'm getting old, kids. I'm getting old. It's Sunday evening. 
I had my 68 hour work week this week, so, you know, things. I am waiting for some form of push. North is still trying. South is still having some trouble here with their pushes. But they have people at the ready. They have people pushing here in. No, I'm wondering. I see a bit of a push, but I don't think there's anything to see. Yeah, there's nothing to see right now. I mean, it's just people in the north and the south that are mostly blocking. Sorry, blocking. Mostly capturing this right now. Yeah. Now, mind you, the 82nd AD is doing well here in the south. It's a smart thing to put it there because you need to decide. You can't directly go like these boys are doing right now up there. They're trying to diagonally push, which, as we have seen with Yelm and others, works out, oddly enough. Uh, but having a bit of a map control situation is much better. Map control is, most cases, always better. Unless you're the much, much stronger team and you can just blast your way anyways through. Now, mind you, 82nd AD has not checked the backlands here. Sexy rocket there! What? Sir Flex, that was a glorious rocket! That was a really well rocket. Have you seen that distance, kids? Beautiful rocket. Now, mind you, that I see both points are getting attacked. Is that on Rutahara somebody, something? Nah, it's just people in the area. Yeah, because Tacotastic has made its way in here. The line has put up some people for the attack. Makes sense. I know, mind you, they could do something well here. Yeah, I'm also missing tank action right now. Is there any tanks? Yes, multiple tanks are making the way. Okay, something is happening. We get a... Is that a three? That's a three dots. That's a heavy tank making its way at the moment, as well as another heavy tank and a medium tank going northwards. Interesting, okay. I would assume they're helping out at the hospice, no, head behind hedges, shooting long range, that kind of stuff. While the others are trying to basically block the inner road system here, probably are going this area, this area, then blasting north-south slash... Left slash diagonal. Something like that. Also, I'm seeing that still there is a lot of power here from the red team. Anything that D is against all odds of you know, hard points local localization. Where the hard points are and against all odds, they are still pushing this point heavily and quite well. That sounds like a bombing run. Can we see? I don't see. Bombing run from 82nd AD cuts through. Is that gonna destroy anybody on the thing? Dylan, yeah, goes down. Destroyed the garrison. That could be big. The other one is currently overrun. Wobbegong. Taking down the garrison from the line. That explosion did not hit Wobble at the moment. Fearing for his life, Potato is closing in, people are closing in. He's not able, why is he not jump? There we go, and the garrison gets saved because of the unbelievable long time of redeploying it, so, uh, removing it. That was a close one, I feel like, though. It was a very close one. Now, mind you, they have a garrison here, which was for a second again overrun. Was that Yelman again overrunning it? No. Where's that garrison? Where is that sneaky little garrison? Oh, down here. Where Tristan is. Is Tristan seeing the garrison, though? Waddling in. Oh, we have a top-down mission. There we go. Spawn close by. Gets the garrison. Dylan does not see the garrison close by getting attacked. And the OP also gets removed. Big play from Tristan here from 82nd AD. Garrison North has again been removed. Garrison situation is awful right now. The line is suffering some loss in the North. They are also still setting up a third attack garrison. <laughs> a third red zone garrison there on the West. Holy mo. 
Holy moly. Uh, 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 uh. Have you got right about us? Oh, he's gonna he's gonna hear all my angriness at the start when people couldn't be bothered to do to, to anything correct. Ah, uh, uh, it's gonna be fun. Bombing run again. I should be an 82nd AD bombing run. Yeah. He's cutting through. Sorry, it's a line bombing run, silly me. Huh. Airhead, okay, airhead, oh, is the time on the airhead, is it already down? Is it down? Did they do it correct? Yeah, there's a proximity warning that airhead went down, okay, good. Very well timed there, nice timing from the line. Did only one man spawn on that airhead just now? Huh. And got killed by Ken for the bob. Huh. Interesting, interesting. I also saw that little rocket there from Chimney and Julian. I would assume there was a garrison there from 82nd AD. I, I cannot see it because we have no cars on the other side, sadly. Sadly. Mind you, this is looking problematic for 82nd AD. Unless they have a tank. Like these guys. Rostein, Wabil, Yamin. And that should have been the thing. Yeah. Was a nice push from the line, though. Was a nice push from the line. But the tank. Good map awareness there. Lovely thing. Also, I feel like people should ping Wild Bill if, you know, when the next videos are. I feel, I feel like that's a thing that should happen. And if he likes to put that into one of the clip things, then sure, go ahead, Bill. <laughs> Who shot you there? Who tried to shoot you there? Which was it, Brazil? I think it was Brazil there, probably. You know what? Let's, let's give the man some. Let's give let's have a little thing on the side. Yeah, they're trying right now to find any kind of gar sorry, garrisons, OPs, other fun facts, no, other fun spots. That could be an issue. But they're not finding anything. Understandably. Understandably. Now, mind you, I do see also that looks make its way. Is that a solo looks? Yeah, fingers on a solo looks. Ha. Huh. Well, Smithers is in a safe spot. Now, mind you, if his allies are not getting spotted, that could work out. Could work out lovely for them. Oh, is Chimney gonna go for the... He's actually gonna go for the anti-tank there. Hits in the butt. Tank is turning. Nice little swoop around. And far too early of a blast. Far too early of a blast. Gets more down, though. Who is he firing against? Nobody. Okay. I would assume he does not know where the shots came from. He knows his shots came from there. Hagrid's arrival is going to psych them out. Not actually being, you know, an anti tanker, but he's going to. Uh, Hagrid, you might want to move. See, that's the thing. You, you can't do some derpies around the tank. You should not stand in front of the tank. That is, that is considered not the greatest play. That is not the greatest play you can do. I'm not going to lie. And right now, still 82nd AD is pushing the midpoint. And for some reason, 82nd AD is able to get into this spot. What madness. What madness is this? Well, madness that works out because they have a tank lost. But who is the tank? Mr. Do. Ooh. Boss Matt and Free Braz. Oh, so all players still alive. That could be a big play, but I would assume that that window is gonna get blasted in a second. No. Oh, Longs goes for a little walk. He might get spotted. He might get spotted. Not getting spotted yet. Puts up the satchel. Could be huge. Should hurry up because they have three people. That spotter is gonna spot. Satchel on the underbelly. Ooh, sneaky. Sexy spot lungs. I would waddle a bit further away because if that thing reverses, he's gonna get squished. Alright, you know what? Because we have a good tradition of not showing the satchel kills on this stream, I'm gonna just stay here for a second. Just for a moment. So lungs gets there, something can put out on the shelf. Ha <laughs> ha! 
But while well, he did get killed by his own statue, he did take down the repair station as well. Good stuff. Mind you, what is also happening is the tank has been destroyed. No, the line tank has been destroyed. And they have been able, at least 80 seconds, he has been able to spawn in with quite a few people. And that does not look like a... Well, it doesn't look like an OP spawn from the amount of people here. Another raid from Alexis. Thank you very much. All the raids. Who is this madness? That looks... Is that... What is that? Is that an airhead? Oh, look at that. That hat is full of air. Yes. But they're getting completely wasted by roof connoisseur. Who died for Garto? And mind you, that is still a good amount of red here on the point. That is quite the amount of people on the area here. And people are hyped about something that happened at the start. I... What a team kill. I don't know what a team kill it was. Oh, that is the initial start. Yes, because people will now see 30 minutes ago the initial start of... <laughs> 82nd AD blasting their own assault squad that were trying to enter the church. Ah, oh, that was good. That was fun. Oh. And I'm doing the cinematics here again because right now this is going to be very, very special because right now 82nd AD is everybody and their grandmother on the hard point. And that is going to be very, very hard to, to counter because right now they... They, they didn't defend the line, did not defend the actual church building, they did not defend no, the northwest there. Mind you, they have defended the north and the south, they have tried to have a counter push there. Uh, the thing is, because I blame teams often for like, oh, why did they not defend this area? Oh, I'm out, but yada yada yada. Why am I doing a fake voice for myself? Yada yada yada. The thing is, we often miss you know, certain like flanks and things, and also here positions were coming. That's a Stucker, that's a German one. American tank about to go boom. And was there, that tank did slightly get damaged, but is still alive. Unlike the hardpoint, who is about to fall. Is 82nd AD going to do the magic here? Are they about to capture this? There's a lot of blue in the area, could still flip back. But look at the amount of stuff. OPs are here. Supplies are here. Garrison is probably also already here, just waiting to get, you know, to become a blue garrison. And that is Rakmarie being captured. After, what is that? 37-ish minutes, 36 minutes and a half. I also see that one little piggy. Oh, Maze in the Creek at the moment. Problematic. Problematic. Because they did not build a single garrison down there. Now one is built. Good, good, good. That's helpful. Resource-wise, the line has been bled dry. Bled dry is that a word? Bled empty? I don't know. English words. Not the greatest situation, though. No, they might be able to defend this easily, mind you. At the moment, they're having huge issues here. Chimney and Joy might get blasted as well. This is not gonna go well, is it? This is not gonna go well. And there is the big attack force coming from the north. That should be easy. That should be doable to blast them all. And that should be a doable thing. And that is the defense of the hard point. Lovely. Yeah, that's gonna be a thing. All right. Yeah, this should be easily defended now in a moment. Mind you, spawn wave coming in again. I am getting worried right now. Counter push also happening. Beautiful. Still, the line is clearing out the spot here. And they're also trying to slow the at the moment to get Zack Marie Egle back. Beautiful play. Yeah, 
And right now? How are they not defending this? They had the upper hand completely. They had so many people here. They had so many people and nobody is bothering to go on the actual hard point. What is this? You know, you just need to move a bit southwards and you have it. You can't just body block this shit. Just go south. Just go south. Bre well, not by breathless. You had much, much more people. Spawning in, still not enough. Thanks all to making the way. And that's gonna be another loss, isn't it? Mason the Creek also falling. Mason the Creek also falling. Ay, 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 ay. Mind you, that squad is getting full, and even though I was told to go to chimney, I might, you know what? It's gonna be on a break for a moment, because, you know, I, I just wanna make sure, you know? Even though, uh, Alberg, why do we not see this? Well, the line told me to join city, and there's no city, so I said, hey, who should I join? Oh, chimney, open in chat. So I joined chimney, and now I'm wrong again. So, next time we're gonna just stay in that squad. F them if they can't be bothered to do any minimum work in the team. I have been really angry on this match. Prior to this, before this, if this is now the next wrong squad, I'm just gonna not bother anymore with the line. That was a really disappointing one today. Really disappointing so far. Where's that fucker? Where's that fucker? But I hope we can't see the match. Yeah, tough titties. Complaint to the line because they couldn't be bothered with giving me the freaking info. Who to join? Oh, to join CD. Who's CD? Oh, CD has a different name. Well, I'm just gonna guess who it is. I'm gonna ask. Oh, different name. Yeah, well, we don't know the name. We're not gonna tell you the actual name. We're gonna say random names. Okay, fuck you then. Sure. See, I'm, I'm really getting pissed off with this shit because it's something easy, easy to avoid and then you might get fucked. Like have the cast in the wrong slot because it couldn't be bothered to do the minimum work. God, I'm annoyed with this. Ah. There we go. And we're back on the menu. Lovely. Lovely. Well, they now have to go to Maze the Creek. Let's see how this one is gonna play out. Lovely. Ah. Now mind you, again, Maze the Creek is an awful point because as you can see, they have to literally go across the whole thing. They could have captured Ruta Ras a dozen of times, but they didn't put anybody on attack. One squad after far too long, they put a few people on, the, sorry, one squad leader in there. Empty whole sec well, sector. Two people in the whole sector, nothing else. Didn't push there, kept defending north and south, and I had to fight over there. Uh, thing is, they had the benefit here with Zack Maria Glee, heavy benefit. Sadly, 82nd 80 AD was able, for them, sadly, was able to push in directly and south and north. And then they committed to the push on Ruta Haras. Did not work out. Then they didn't have enough people on St. Marie Eglie. Lost St. Marie Eglie. Then they had nothing on Mason the Creek. One garrison then after everything was already... Well, not lost. But the sector was lost. Then one garrison alive. Ah, I hope that's gonna help in the future. Ay, 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 ay. Ay, 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 ay. Ah. And right now... Even with only being the sector, they have some push power here. No mind you, it would be glorious if they get this back in a moment. Wouldn't be love. No mind you, they do have to do a thing which is called attacking. They had a problem there on the route to Haras. Had huge issues there, they had only one squad. Now mind you, they are now on the extra drive. Now we're seeing the line actually attack in a line. Oddly enough, I know, amazing. They have everything at the ready, they have everything set, they should just blast this in. Promise, of course, a distance, because they have to make it all the way from here to there. Two sectors of running. That is gonna be a painful one to do. That is gonna be a painful one to do. Mm -mm -mm. Now mind you, they are fighting the 82nd AD, also a group of veterans. They do have one benefit, though I remember the 82nd AD in the past at least had some issues when it came to defending their, their points. As we have seen on, on Ruta Haras so far, 
problem is right now they literally need to go from this point to this point. So they, their attack is also the defense. That's the big benefit right now. Because Eddie Secondly was, I have to say this awful with their defense a little bit us. It's just the luck because the line did not push the point in any way. And now the benefit for them is that the area they need to attack is also the area they need to defend. So that is going to be very, very helpful for them. And it's going to be very helpful for them. Mm -mm -mm. Yes, Robert has actually left. Never mind, he was. Nah, it was Bill that was in the tank. Yes, yes, yes. Not that tank. Jumping up in the sky. Long range rocket there from Bones. Did that connect or did that hit in the ground before? Ah, hit in the ground before. Ah, just a bit too short. Just a bit too short. And Bones has been, yeah, removed from the living. There we go. 45 minutes. Halfway time is over. We still have a lot of gameplay up ahead. And I am wondering right now. I am wondering right now. Ah, we gotta see a glorious return here from the line. I would love to see a comeback. Yeah, I would love to see them no, take this hard back because right now, this is a big steep hill they have to climb. Mason the Creek is an awful point for the Allies to take back. And mind you, they are already pushing in. I would love to see a comeback from the line here. What a glorious time that would be. What a glorious match, match that would be. And that is another tank. That is another tank going down. I would assume that is an access tank. That is indeed an access tank. Any second they losing one of the Pumas. I don't know why I had a problem with the word there. Southern push is happening. Southern push is going very smoothly. I mind you, it's only four people, but they could if they keep that OP, which I would assume is there. Yeah, if they keep that OP alive, they can still move, you know, in many, many different ways. And hopefully, hopefully. Yes, long to get you. No, mind you, they are not having enough people to defend the OP here. Is it already gone? Not gone yet. Bocek. Not seeing the OP. Get shot from behind. And the OP gets removed. However, spawn hell. Spawn still works. Flick, not realizing that it has been removed, leaves the area and gets killed on the way there. <laughs> And again, they're slightly pushing the point here, slightly contested. They need to get something going here. They need to get something going. Little push happening there. They need tank support from is they have lost most of their tanks before they have used up all their fuel. And right now they're getting pummeled by that lovely light tank up in the north. Making their way closer and closer. Only Hagrid alive could do something amazing here. Tank also down. Glorious shot there. The line is coming back. Beautiful thing here. Gunshot <laughs> Hagrid not aware of each other, I guess. Okay. I mean, sure. Rockets also flying past. Surely Agrid has heard it. Yet. Now yeah, grenade. He's like looking at the sky. Grenade should be down here in a moment. Too high. Should talk to Frogger. There we go. Much nicer rocket. And I do hear a bombing run, which is French for bombing run. Oh, goes down! 82nd AD bombing run goes down the line, literally in this case. Oh, in three ways, that is a line, that was the line, and it goes well in a line. Ooh, lovely. All the fun stuff. All the fun stuff. Ah, seems like we have at least one lovely little tank here. Let me just end this. One little tank at least making its way here. 
Where's that tank? Where are you, tank? Tank in the tank. Familiar faces, Greco, little sticky, and Coletto. And Rocket goes in, goes over, and kills a grasshopper in the field. That is a very dead grasshopper. Now, mind you, the line is coming back from this as I was predicting. I did not predict this, but I'm happy that it's happening. I'm happy because I like it. I like when it's not going back and forth. It's not just a stalemate thing. No. And right now, well-deserved comeback there from the line. Artillery oddly not killing people. I guess, yeah, because of the angle hits the... No? I'm sure Garth Dorf didn't die there. Ah. Eh, angles. It's like magnets, nobody understands them. There we go with the blasts. Now mind you, the spawn wave has been a thing here on the 82nd AD side. They have put in quite the amount of people. But I see the line already in the north. That tank is too damaged. And the tank is dead, yep. Counter push? What? Is nobody defending this in any way? What? Ah, it's just one assault player. Okay. One assault player on the garrison. You might want to at least have like one or two guys defending. That would be that would be that would be good. That would be good, boys. I'm getting up to that. Sergio was apparently 501. I thought he was 501. Was he not multi use bastardos? Ah, sorry about that one. And that is the whole run of, of, of the push. Okay. I mean, we also do watch these little pushes. So mind you, I would love to see who I'm actually going to go north here for a moment. Because Roof Connector and others... Sorry, Roof Connector, sir, and others are making over here. Southward, that should be a juicy little attack. And again, it's that old issue of... Do I look left? Do I look right? Or do I look pretty, pretty much dead? Right now, artillery from the line should hit this compound area, blasting this area. Not happening. And there we go, they are shelling the watery ditch, really? There we go, okay, they're shelling the south still. I guess, I guess fair enough because they have highlights. No, they have not. Why, why are they shelling? What? Oh, because there was a spawn before and they saw the spawn happen. Okay, okay fair enough. Biplane. Mind you, the line is in a great position still. I know uh, what the last half went on, but yeah, but they're in a good position to take back this lovely hard point of Mason the Creek here. They have everybody at the ready. They have people in the north, they have people in the east, they have people in the south. Mind you, the people in the south... No, the people in the south are actually doing well. Do we have a tank down here from the Axis variety? No, we have a lot of the line, though. The line is heavily down here. And Colton is running to his death. Huge push from the south. Got to a team kills. What is it with 80 Sunday team killing people that are doing something good? What is this? And the blood is. So, can somebody clip? What was that blood just now? Did the blood. Was that just a texture that was applied downwards? And it hovered over the tank? That was weird. Mind you, tank fights. Don't think they have still the vision where they're getting shot from. They're just trying to waddle backwards in a serpentine line. They need to go a bit more right. Still, I can still get shot from this. The zone is slowly closing. I think now they might be fine. Yeah, they're going outside. Ooh, yeah, just barely, but they are fine. They should be fine. The push is also happening. People on the hard point. Now, mind you, they need to remove the garrisons. They need to remove the garrisons. Mind you, they might actually have removed the I would have loved if we had another castle. Yes. Ah, but I see. Was that a... Uh... Yeah, that's the garrison still. Okay. Defending again, that garrison is birthing so many extra soldiers right now. Contested halfway there, that should be a motivator for the line to push in the heart. And mind you, they have lost some push power here in the north. They have lost some push power here, still capping it. 82nd AD. Where's 82nd AD? They should have everybody here right now. Is there anything happening on. No. Monsieur de Ferme is empty. 82nd ID is doing some north stuff, okay. And then they go with the spawn wave. Mind you, that sweet spot, that sweet spot, but it just hit artillery. You should keep hitting that spot. Yes, good artillery, there we go. 
Right now, they are defending it slightly. Then again, TL has not enough people here in the areas. I counter my argument and remove it instantly. Mind you, Teresa now also hammering down in the south, which is 82nd AD's artillery. And it's going to hit a lot of people that are making their way to the north here. That is going to be painful. Mind you, if they can somehow... Yeah, that's the thing. They're going to get farmed down in the south. And that gives 80 second enough time to get into buildings, get into trenches, get to the spots where they're not gonna die instantly. Also, I think I heard a tank. Is he getting shot from somewhere? Yes, yeah, retreating. Where's that tank? Oh, that was a nice diagonal little thing. Look at that. There we go. Roman, Pito, and Anon. Eh, 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 mouse. There we go. Look at that! Look at the distance these boys are shooting. I, uh, it's always nice for another non com players. The level they're shooting! High tree, by tree, through here, and then they're hitting people here in this area. Look at the firefights com teams are doing. It's fun. And I'm just flew too high. There we go. <laughs> now, mind you, 82nd AD is slowly losing ground again. They have everybody here in the area. So, sorry. I need to call correct it. They're not losing that much ground. They're losing a bit now here with Roof and the others. Ne? But it's just they're getting overrun with enemy players right now. It's too many to handle. Now, do they have still their garrison up and running? Is that still a thing? Garrison has been removed. They have not the ability to spawn in quickly enough anymore. Mind you, they might have something else there. Somewhere around the north, probably. And offwards. But that right now is potentially... That could potentially be the comeback for the... Rupan is taking down the OP here. Panda is also pushing in. Did his crowd dog also here. And the hard point. Bibbidi, boobidi, ba. Goes to the line, who's us There we go. I know these rhymes are not great, but you know. Just happens on the side there. Now, mind you, still, the line has now captured the point. Mind you, they are not having it under control yet. They have the point, but they have it not under control. It's still partially 82nd AD territory. Mind you, do we have any garrisons? Not yet. Is that a bombing run? Okay, might come. Uh, tank of the south, garrison there. They have set up some garrisons. Nice garrison station. Nice garrison in the north. Bombing run coming down. I'm actually going to capture that for a second. Yeah, well, let's make it, let's make it cinematic. For the, for the line, uh, uh, um, memorial play, I don't know. Ah, beautiful. <laughs> oh, it's loud. It could have moved at least five feet. Ah, was alright. Was alright. Now, mind you, there is a big wave. There's a big wave of 82nd AD still coming from the west. And the OPs, of course, did not get removed, which I still... I'm not so sure about it. feel like OPs should also get removed by, you know, bombing runs. But that is something that the comp teams and the public players need to uh, sort themselves. They need to sort that out themselves. Rocket goes far? Rocket goes somewhere? Rocket goes next to cannon for the bomb. Doesn't kill Bob though. Now mind you, I feel like 82nd AD is not going to capture this back in any near future as in the next five minutes because I think the line is going to actually break through here and they're going to start defending towards the west more and more here in a moment. Yeah, probably. Yeah, that's going to be that's gonna be a bit of a push power there. So mind you, they are losing a lot of people there to enemy artillery. And even though it's only one artillery player, that is still hammering down on crucial spots. If that OP gets removed, that could be a big one, because that is going to be a thorn in their sides until it gets removed. But Ruf Konosor and Inferno are doing very well here. Until they get completely right. Is that, a, is that an MG or is that... That's MG, that's kind of for the buff. Never mind. I thought it was another tank fight. But mind you, as, like, as we can see, we have two the line tanks on the left here. And not a lot of enemies. That can take our tanks. I mean, Flip is there, but Flip is... Why do we push us into that dark green now? Ah, every patch has something new and fun. There we go. The morphing bushes. Lovely. 
But what is happening in the rest of the world? We're gonna go down on the very special little point, which is the holy place of Zack Marie Eccle. <laughs> For a second I thought it was a rocket. For a second I thought in the bottom left there was a rocket going in. Look, like... <laughs> it's just a vault. <laughs> Sorry. Oh look, I can make a rocket appear. Bum. There we go. Jokes aside, at the moment, 82nd AD has the hard point under Sankt Marie Glee is in the hands. Uh, that being said, the line has already set up a bit of a situation here. They should be able to get this back. I don't want to say pretty easily, but they have the a bit of an advantage when it comes to taking this back. It's more on their side. No, to be fair, that's going to be helpful. Mind you, they lost one garrison up here. I think I feel like it was two garrisons before. Also, I feel like they are a bit further back now. Is that true or is it just me? No, it might have been Jem who... <coughs> Quack indeed. Was that just Chimney... That was Chimney taking down a thingy. Was that a Puma? Ah, it was probably Wild Bill. Ah, it was probably Wild Bill that got wasted there. Oh well, oh well, oh well. Now, mind you. Right now. The line is pushing in again. Into St. Maria Gli Trying to take it back half an hour left. Means 28 minutes, more or less, to get the point back. And they have the benefit that the point was already at their hands, so they already know the taste of the point. They have the forward garrisons here at the moment. Maze the Creek is still a bit fought over, I would say. Let me just go back there. For yeah. That's, that's, not, that's not gonna get taken anytime soon. They still have two tanks, then the backlands defending the point. That is going to take a moment to become anything like a heavy push. Especially if 82nd AD has no other thing that they have a tank now, mind you. They do have a little tank here close by. That is a nice thing. Promise he has no... I would assume... What is it? Not insignia, what is it called? Uh, markers, that's the word. Don't think they have any helpful... Marks for those tanks. And I think those tanks have also moved partially slightly. Ooh, it was a hit. Was that down here somewhere? Yeah, it was here. No, not that tank. There was a tank down here, right? Yeah, there we go. Oh, it was a puck cannon. Okay. Okay. Interesting. And there is the actual tank that I was saying. Okay. For a second, I thought that, that puck has not shot directly there. That's not a, the thing the puck can do, not that angle. And this is not enlisted. We can't move it. And the... The wreck that was blocking it has been destroyed. The tank is now in the open. Nearly running over. <laughs> we'll drop it there. Now, mind you, those are three repair stations, but they're all smoking. Uh, all under work, all under pressure. And got repaired, because why wouldn't they? Wait, actually, actually, are repair stations repairing each other? I actually don't, I don't know that one. I, I guess the repair stations are repairing everything. Are they repairing other repair stations? Can you auto repair? No. That's up for the, for the brain. You mind you, while they are doing the little fine tanking here and they will lose some. Basically, what's gonna happen is they're gonna blast this area more and more. They're gonna destroy some of the repair stations. And at some point, that tank might die unless it is able to blast the people over here in this area, which is gonna take some time. And mind you, they have still both. No, that one is dead. Yeah, that one is destroyed. They have one tank left. They have Zuma there and causes his repairman. So they have some backup here that should be fine. Attack is going to take some time because the line is now pushing westwards further and further. They have cleared out their own little area. That means they are going to inferno nearly killing roof connoisseur there. Good thing we have that on record. Confirm. And while I'm being confused, I see it confused down here against the Spanish and gets <sighs> destroyed by the Inquisition. Don't expect that one. Now, mind you, the line is setting stuff up. That is a bit worrying that there is a alarm already up there. And that garrison is far away. I would love to see a garrison up here somewhere. You know, that got also removed. That is... Oh, really? So I'm just going to go over there for a second. What? Who is taking down the garrisons up there? Maybe the whole squad is defending the north. There we have a little squad defending the north. Don can for the bob and builds. So, uh, and for a second I thought, wait, Briggy is playing for 80 seconds? No, it's Biggles, not, not Briggy. Briggy is Rob and the others. I'm mixing up the people. 
But I mean, they have stuff here at the ready. They have something on the cemetery. Mind you, one big spawn wave they could push into the point, could do some magic here. 22 minutes left. That's more than enough time to do the big plays here. And I know that 82nd AD is still holding this. I still have the feeling that the L could win this. Mind you, one big, one big reason is that 82nd AD has shown problems with when it comes to defending at least some of the areas. No? Uh, mind you, the line has proven to be able to defend and recapture area. With attacking, there was a bit of an odd one there at the start, but they have shown that they can recapture points. Mind you, can they also look at... Nope, they can't look at the back. Not necessary. Psychotastic goes also... Jesus Christ. Jesus Christ. Theory is helping them out. That's good. That's good. And remember, kids, that again... Good thing that the, the prone jump has been fixed, because now, but nobody can now go on roofs. It's very good. That's very good that nobody can go on roofs. Nobody can go on a roof anymore. That's the important part. Nobody can go on a roof in this game anymore. Oh, and bloody, is bloody on TL? What was it? Another one was double. I, I keep forgetting where people are joining and jumping to. I, I, I have no vision there. But I think Berserk Castle. Uh, uh, what is? Is it Berserk at the moment? Is it Berserk? Is it Berserk Castle? I have lost the, the name at this point. Uh, I think on his Discord you can see like, like people that jump from one team to another, where, where people are switching to. I think there's like a little plug-in thing. If not, just ask somebody on HCA Discord or the other thing. I hear a thing, and it's called Stuka. Stuka goes down here. But of course, the Stuka does not destroy the giant 50 kilo bomb. Does not destroy the tank. Yep. Only damages them slightly. There we go. Well, heavily, sir, via fair. <laughs> it's nice though seeing people just, just free people just jump out and repair. And that was a precision strike. How quick, how long does it take? That was a precision strike nearly directly on the thing. How long does it take to repair that thing? They just jumped out all. Three man repairing, safe spots. What we let's take a sip there for my drink. And they're all done with the job. Are they? Jesus Christ. So that was all the resources spent, and the tank is already repaired again. <laughs> Fart noises. More planes coming in. South is looking dire for 82nd AD. They do have. Now, I was going to say, why do they have an American ticket? No, that is the line. The South has fallen completely. <laughs> Look at that, look at that. Tiger tank is down, three repair stations are down, there's still supplies lying in the area, there's one repair station left, and the American tank is making its way forward with Mr. Do, Bossman, and three bras. Is there anything on this road that you need to worry about? I'm just gonna swoosh along the road. Nope, don't see a tank, don't see a mine, don't see anything. I think the main road is not being protected at all. That is gonna be them having a clear road. Wherever they want to go, basically. All right. It was a fascinating little scene, wasn't it? Yeah. And right now we see Coco also making his way there in the middle grounds. They're making their way everywhere. They're spreading out. I can actually show the map. That's the great thing. Strike Force in the South. Combined arms. Beautiful. Beautiful combined arms situation. No. Diagonal push there with a little squad. Beautiful. And also frontline push and all stuff. Now this is the line I want to see. They are getting a bit of a touch there on Mason the Creek, but again, that's... Really? Eh, it should be fine. Should should be fine. Seriously, it should be fine. And Jim redeployed because he realized that he has no ammo, and that's... Yeah. Little frog is still alive. Bad timing. Ah, oh, he's gonna watch that and he's gonna get so angry with the timing. Then. Uh. But yeah, that's gonna that's gonna take a moment. I mean, the garrison there is in full view. That's gonna get spotted by him. Yep, Frog is spotting the enemy garrison there. Might not get removed instantly. Might, they might just keep it there. And then basically wait for him to be uh, a little sleeper agent just to make his way there. Now, mind you, he has started shooting, so they know that he's down there. And Frogus has been kicked. 
Sorry, killed. <laughs> Kicked. Highland has come up. I would have put it a bit more on the right. I don't see a spawn there or anything. No, there is a spawn there. That was an odd little accent that I just said. Spawn is there. Uh, is that gonna work out? Yeah, I mean, people are gonna spawn, keep on spawning there. Timing wise, they could blast in a second. Eh? Uh, come on. Blast Star Lord? What? Okay. Would have been fun. Would have been fun. Middle point flickering. Saint Marie Eglis is getting Eglis. Flick all to the front. I'm gonna zoom in here a bit. Oh, flick about to. Good time there. Good reflexes. He's going on that side. Yeah. No. Oh my god. It's the, and you might say, well, but why are you watching on this little push? Because these little pushes are the ones that are surprising me well. And that change a lot of things. Yama doesn't hear the shot. Ah, he hears the shot. He's looking now. OP has been built. Flick gets killed. Where's where's that? Oh, he's coming. Ah, yes, exactly. There he is, yes. We can also close in. And it's these little pushes you need to watch once in a while. You can't see the whole, uh, the big so picture. But you see these moments, it's all about, because if that OP had been seen just now, if Yelman would have checked this area right now, he would have removed the OP and the whole thing would have been clear. Right now there's a big wave now coming in, Longs is making it, but they could remove the thing. But ah, oh, but Yelman didn't know that there was an OP there. Yeah, yeah, I know, that's the thing, he doesn't know, but now people know. They didn't see the spawn again. Heavy goes in. Does not see that it's getting shot. And Longs. Still not. And does not take down the OP. And that's the thing. Because he, if he sees the bottom of this, he's going to say, F me. Why did he not go F feet? Ah. Yes, Leah. 30 minutes ago. Ah. I think this is like 30 minutes ago I switched to the, the, the squad because nah, it was clear that clearly it was apparently the wrong squad because they did tell me the wrong thing. I like it when stuff can <sighs> Lovely. <sighs> Lovely. And Hagrid is going full ham. Hagrid is drawing a line, and in this case, it's a line made out of blood and bone. That sounds good. Go south, massive cam. They're all south. Nose all south. My kiss. There we go. Beautiful play there from Hagrid. He's also getting southwards, trying to fight where people are dying. No, they could just keep pushing north. No, fair enough. But they are clearing out the south so their push doesn't die. Smart thing from Hagrid there. He's not just saying, okay, we're gonna push it into the chap the chap into the church now, it's over. No no, they're trying to clear out their push power here. Because if people fall behind them, then it is over. Right now, no, some people are making the way, but Bones is doing the right thing. He's looking around, trying to find spots. He's trying to find out where the in the in the enemies are, so the OPs don't get destroyed. Because Shroud Dog right now might remove a lot of OPs. Well, one. But one is all you might need. And that is Roof Bandit. Yeah, gets the kill, looks at the angle. Two people spawn in, flick, there we go. Good job from Roof Connoisseur. And that is getting a bit lava lamp. Like, look at the amount of red dots and blue dots in random directions. And that tank has been not abandoned, but is alone at the moment. And gets the destroyed American tank down. That is not great news for their push power here. Uh, they still have the garrison up here, which is really helpful. Mind you, garrison here would be lovely, but that is overrun at the moment. Uh, diddle 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 diddle. Mace the Creek has one garrison. Nice backup situation here, garrison-wise. Mind you, there is a third tank makes way, and there's a recon tank in the south. Only one tank, though. So one, one driver, person, crewman, whatever you want to call it. But 82nd AD is not having a lot of people on the actual hard point. The south is also falling. The south is also falling. 
And I have the highlight on. There we go. That's better. And I do like that we have that push power in the north from the line right now. That is beautiful. They are setting everything up there in the north to push southwards. So southwards. Birds. Now, mind you, the push in the south, but that was what Hagrid, I would assume at least, what Hagrid was trying to do here. He was trying to set everything up and basically clear out the southern area so they can then from that point on push northwards while the south is safe. Saturday that, that fell through, more or less. And now that whole south sector where they could have had a, a second attack point from has fallen into the hands of the enemy. And now any that he has actually an area here where they can spawn back in from and harass the actual push on Sankt Marie Eglé. Mind you, there is people here, but they're getting completely decimated by artillery. I know there was not 10 people, so I can't say decimated, but you know. More than use of the word decimated. Oh my god! There we go! Lucky find there from Slavic. That was a close one. That would have been bad. That would have been very bad. <sighs> and mind you, there is still a lot of blue here in the north, but 82nd is holding the cheese house here. Which is always nice. Zanzu, big name, at least when he's playing anti-tanker. Not doing that right now, which is a bit of a pity. I do like a good Zanzu rocket. Because, you know, I'm, I'm really bad with remembering names. But if, if you get remembered by me for something you did especially, that means, that means you have done some really good stuff. Because I remember nearly no names. I'm really bad. I'm old. You know, I'm old. Very old, yes. At least I'm feeling that way. <laughs> so if I remember your name, then wow, you did something good. Especially if I remember what you did. Who is this Teko test? Nah, I know Teko as well. I know the boss. <laughs> Up in the sky, I hear a bombing run make its way, and that is an 82nd AD bombing run. We should probably bomb there. Oh, far north. Okay, is that a bombing run against the garrison? No. Sorry, what? Misses the MG as well. Uh, that bombing run didn't kill a single person and did not destroy any garrisons. Okay. Um. Okay. That's a thing that just happened. Vehicle destroyed. I see one man running around. There will probably be a yeah tiger tank, access tank down. Eleven minutes to start capturing this back. Push is happening. They have a bit of a blocker here with popped out in peace there. They are getting hammered though from Beverbang. Be Beverbang, there we go, bird. That tank on the point could be big. How many people? Three people. Coletto, Cracker, and Little Sticky. That could be if they are. If they are they in the zone? Uh, silly me. Are they in the zone? Oh, bird. The point is here. Yeah, I keep I keep forgetting that it's not here. You know, you, you hear Sankt Maria Kling, you think, yeah, the whole point is going to be. No, no, it, it's this area, not this area. But mind you, they are close by. They can't really advance right now. They have no enemy tankers, enemy anti-tankers, all the other fun in here. They can't advance at the moment the tank. Just stay safe. And wait for infantry, who is currently having some issues here. I'm gonna go for one second on the defense here on the second point because it is getting contested. I'm just curious why or how. Uh, what? Oh, sorry, Russo. Yeah, sorry. <laughs> uh, nothing. It's just, it's just, yeah, it's it's one of old squad player. Okay. Bit of an angle push. They are pushing 82nd. Might want to watch this one as well. 82nd AD also pushing southeastwards. That could be big. Mind you, if they want to, I would at this point maybe only, I don't know, it feels like you shouldn't have too many people there in the south. You should have like a, eh, I mean, it was a fair amount. It was a good amount. Yeah, fair enough. That group is there to push, oh sorry, to, to kill people diagonally, that's fine, that's also working, yeah, sure. I feel like you should push... Ah! Sorry, I, I, I'm thinking of 82nd AD, I feel like they need to push more eastwards. I know that there's the enemy outbreak, you see that, yeah. But they need to clear this out. Now I see that they are doing the magic here from the north, they're trying to cut through here, presumably, where Biggles is. Also tank fight, ah, we just missed the tank fight. With the last tanker still being alive and taking the kill. Little sticky.
Everybody else from his squad is dead. He's the last man alive. Takes down the enemy Panzer IV. And is now repairing it. <laughs> He's repairing it back to life. Oh, not. Uh, in the meantime, Eddie Segment D has pushed in with many, many more people. The light needs to get more blood on this ground. They lost the garrison up there. They have one directly, directly right now there. I hear the bombing run. That is not... That could actually be good. Yeah, people inside buildings. Might actually kill. No, Hagrid is also going in. Satchel went off. Wiped the whole interior, mind you. That bombing run might have killed the garrison. We were gonna zoom out here a bit. We're gonna watch the area, just seeing if there's any, you know, you know multi squat uh, squat leader spawns. So if you see any squat leader spawn, like a double group, eh, you let me know. Yes, let me know. The line pushing in heavily spawned. A little bit of a lag there for a second, like a little stuttering. Interesting. Also, a little Stuart tank driving through the back lines. Hey, Tanji! I haven't seen Tanji. Hi, Tanji. I haven't done, seen Tanji in ages. There is a bit of a capture situation also getting into the second point, but I feel like we're going to focus on this one unless we're going like one third on uh, the second point. Like, I feel like Mason Creek is not a thing we need to... I mean, it's just proximity. Look at that. The garrison's not even right. Red. Right now, this is the big one we should focus on. Right now, 82nd AD is also aware of this. They are putting everybody and their grandmother on the point. Three men in that tank, also getting into... Are they gonna... I think they're outside, though, are they? Yeah. Bit dangerous there. Bit dangerous there, because if they had a satchel or anything, they would have wiped the whole no, push there. Are they now... Yeah, they are! They're not staying. Oh, they could stay in that little corner. They're not getting blasted. Oh, they, they thought they saw somebody there, I guess. Speaking of seeing people. Oh boy. That's not gonna go nice. Oh, Kokos, you can save the green. No, Kokos doesn't see the anti tanker. No! Oh, Kokos doesn't see the anti tanker. And the tank goes down. No! Statue has been placed on the ball of the holy building. That should clear out quite a bit here. We're gonna zoom out. Let's have a little bit of a drift there, because we can. Slight little drift. There we go. That is gonna roof quite a few people. Now, mind you, the line needs to get more people onto the area here. We need to clear off the... I mean, they have six minutes left right now. They have six minutes left. That is a clear out. Good. Now they're pushing in. Good timing there. Explosions coming down. They're also not dying to northern power here. Artillery is blasting everybody apart, though. Artillery is wiping them by the numbers. Bones made it inside. That is good. Could put something up there in the others. Oh, spawn wave. That is gonna be awful. Bones against three people. That's not gonna work out. It does well, though. And now it's just who can make it into the holy place. Who can make it into Zack Marie Igli? Who can make it into the church? Let me go. Any second AD, Jem and others are pushing there from the east behind the lines, removing OPs. The line needs to bolster up there. They need to expand. Northwest, west, and southwest. And zooming out so we get the bigger picture. And still, it's still either good for... Sorry, it's good still for either team. Still good for either team. Now, mind you, 82nd AD had enough time to put people in the north, and the line has not done the counter here. South also, they're focusing on the little thing. I mean, they're trying to survive in this little holdout area there on the right. Ah, I feel like this might go to 82nd AD here. This might go to 82nd AD. This might go to 82nd AD. 
No, oh, still four minutes left to start capturing this. They have stuff at the ready. Right. Let me just. Oh my god. Uh, the mouse. Uh, uh, uh. So let's move. I know. Let's, let's move. There we go. Let's angle this a bit nicer. There we go. Is that a Greyhound tank down there? Interesting. Map for a moment just so we see how it is. I mean, they have three tanks. They have three. Uh, sorry. They have two heavy tanks here and one little recon tank with two people. They have stuff here at the ready just to push in. If they have some combined arms, they could do something. Garrison situation is awful. They lost their garrisons. They didn't defend the garrisons. The offensive. Uh, sorry. They have been removed. And they have now a nice little red zone garrison. Which is that could be big. Now, mind you, they have killed people here close by. And now the enemy knows that people are here. I would assume that we're going to see Gem or somebody here in a moment make their way spawn around here or make their way northwest in a moment. Would be lovely to not see that because Gem would probably take them down here. Also, maybe Ken for the Bob and M would, would expect here to see pop up in a moment. That is a lot of squad leader icons. That is a lot of that is a lot of squad leaders. Everybody and their uncle is now a squad leader. They are losing their second point though. Just gonna do a little swoop. Yeah, that is nobody on the defense anymore. Mason the Creek is empty of the line. Precision strike is being done, which is not gonna do. Are they literally gonna hit? Dope hope that no. For one second, I'm just gonna watch this. Nah, it's gonna be. Nah, it's gonna hit. Nah, it's not gonna hit. Looked cool. Yeah, it's gonna be a problem. They have two minutes to start capping this. They have a few people in the south. The east side has been nearly completely has been completely wiped. They're now making their way in. Tank did not kill both of them. Alan survived. Okay. Also, don't forget, kids, that you know you can't get on roofs anymore because they removed the the jump drone thing. It's not a thing anymore. You can't do. It doesn't exist anymore. Only one man in the tank, confused, I think, was not able to put the session down, and Kendra is gonna... Yeah, and gets more down. Still, it could go. They just need to start capping it in one and a half minutes, then we're good. One and a half minutes to start capping this. Just need to do that little extra step. Could still work. They are defending the other point as well. They are getting people in. And they're coming on the side. They're coming on the side. Yes, they're coming from the side. That is... Oh, God. They got... Did they just get all wiped by cold start? Holy sh... Okay. Kenda up there is going to be annoying until they find him. I don't think they're going to be seeing him that close. Yeah, because everybody's just going to die here. That spot is going to be so painful. They're trying to break three or 45 seconds to do the magic. Spawn wave and they get diminished there from a little squad from a tankers. From tankers? Really? Good God. And I don't want to say it, but I don't think they're going to be able to... I don't think they're going to be able to get this back right now. They are not going to be able to get this back. 18 seconds, they would need to push with everybody right. And they would need to basically stand on the point right now here. And that is not a bombing run. Is that a bombing run? It's a bombing run. Right? Yeah. Bombing run from the line. Taking the last life out of the push. The last men making their way there. And we have the GG. The line with a glorious attempt of a comeback did not work out. Ah, oh, what a thing. What a thing. Ah, I feel like we need music right now. We need other music. Also, let me just go through the high score because people want to see the high score. High score. There we go. There we go. You can pause the what if you want to see the high score. There we go, kids. Ah, and what am I? I'm gonna make the thing pin. There we go. No spoilers. Or oh, you get slapped. Here we go. Message. Unpin at the end of the stream. I feel like we need different music though. That's something we need. Music. That is much better. 
Ah, there we go. Music. Victory towards 82nd AD. After a long and bravely fought match, the line both teams doing very well here in the long run. Was a bit of a what a bit of a strange one there with, with the 82nd AD not defending Ruta Ras with anybody at the start. You might you might have watched this. Ruta Ras not getting defended by anybody, but the line not pushing either in in any way. Then the point got overrun completely. With 80 seconds just strolling through the open roads in for some reason while the line was defending north, south, everywhere else. But that little diagonal push. The meat grind zone was not a meat grind zone, it was just an empty space. And they went in, captured that, and they already had people there at Mason the Creek. Tanks and all the other goodies. Then the line from the last point getting attacked came back, took Mason the Creek, and pushed all the way back to the mid grounds. Which was quite impressive. Ah, lovely. Ah, lovely. Oh, things. Yes, yes, things. Sure, 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 sure. Uh, you things. Where, 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 Told the wrong names. Quack indeed, Ed, bro. You know. Anyways, that was the match. I hope you had some fun. And we have some lovely matches. We hopefully are going to rate somebody in a moment, depending on that, because 30 minutes delay. Right now, it's uh, 22... Sorry, 22.39 at my place. So it's going to be like... It's going to be like... Oh, what could it be like? Oh, bro. Yeah, it's going to be... Nine after. Yeah, fair enough. But that has been the match. I hope you had some fun. Uh, more streams for me during the week, uh, some competitive matches on the weekend. And yeah, then also maybe a 24-hour stream next week, we will see about that one. But that has, that has been it for the match, TL against 82nd AD. Both teams deserve to win here, only one was able to take it. And I, I could drag this on, but I feel like we should raid somebody. That is the thing we should do, let's be fair. So. I'm just going to play a little outro, you are going to have some fun, and I'll be seeing you next week. Have a good week, bye bye! Mwah.